Hello, hello everybody, it's your boy Prof Chop, and we're back again with a new video, part 2 baby, horror movies, characters I can beat again, by Degenerosity, let's go y'all, hey, it's Bubba, Ooh, that was close, Wait, this part was so funny in the movie, come on, it's all those October, parts, really. one of my favorite holidays where everyone gets to dress up as who we really hey, are, yo, Damn, Kratos went the to white as hell. Close. And since Halloween is coming, yeah. or here already, I don't know when this video is going to be posted. And I've been watching more horror movies, and I feel stronger than ever. I bet I can God take damn. on anybody. I've been snorting trend. I wanted to run it back on more. Snorting trend. That work, brother? Let me know. Four movie characters I could beat in the ring. I've scored damn. five lines of muscle, milk, and protein power. I'm damn. I'm going to do the same rating as last time. Hey. Ten, I'm winning one. Okay, first off, we got to talk. Listen. If you are that much smaller than another human being, don't start a fight with them, okay? Weight classes exist for a reason. I'm sprinting. Come on, brother. Don't do that. Predator? Okay. Predator. No chance you actually win a fight versus the Predator. Straight up. You're not Arnold. You're not a uh, movie Arnold. But they have a honor code that I've read about that says that if you're too much of a he a bit they ain't gonna fight your ass because it's seen as dishonorable to kill a, like such a piece of shit so i don't think they'd even go for me okay oh, out to no. win <laughs> nah, i think that's an out to win boy bro he let me uh, give y'all the basic rundown of Carrie. I don't have my she coffee. Okay, I have no coffee. Girl who gets bullied a lot Never during school Carrie. with a super ultra religious nut of a mom who okay. is also super overprotective because I guess Carrie got some mob psycho powers. Oh, not shit. Important. We're talking movie, about super powers. One of the bullies ask her out to prom God and she damn. gullible enough to not say yeah. Then she gets pranked. <laughs> gotcha. She then kills everybody at the school with her powers. You know. Hey, yo. All right. Even the people that didn't bully her? Holy moly. Fast forward with all my yapping. Can I beat this girl in a fight? Or not? Now, of course, I can't beat her mean? in the boxing ring, you know. She got mob psycho powers. The hell yeah, can I brother. do? I'm not Professor X, but I do hey. have a brain. Hey, yo, what's going on Dragon Ball Z nowadays, brother? I got some ideas. So if huh? you ain't seen the movie, the bully that mm -hmm. asked her out died by getting a bucket dropped on his head and not by care. So the buckets in this universe must be made of titanium yeah, giga nigga steel. Just gonna so say I'm gonna just throw one of the buckets out hey, of her head and hopefully it knocks dope. her ass out. And if Boondocks. it doesn't, or she stops it midair, oh, I'm kind of screwed. But a good snipe would also do the job. I'm gonna give her a five good out of ten. Snipe. She bucket diff. I feel like you can only get her by surprise. Just like how the sponsor that catches you by surprise is the sponsor. I mean, if you shot her from far away, I mean, it's America, right? Y'all got guns and shit. Why don't you pop a bitch, huh? Superpower this. My Timo. Timo is the best oh, online God. store. Homie threw us in the sweatshops. God damn, bro. Killer come from out of space. Wait, have I seen this one? Now, these ones are out of the ordinary. This movie what is the about hell is this? killer clowns from out of space. And they take over this town and start going on a streak. Now, these things are some of the worst things you can think of. They're murderous. Wait, are these dudes in costumes or is it like straight up some alien shit? Clown. Aliens. Now, okay. unlike Pennywise's lame ass, these dudes are an actual threat to the population. Whoa. They got a cotton candy gun that turns dudes into cotton candy. They got a man eating popcorn. They could make what? shadow puppets that could actually hey, kill yo. people. Acid pies. And they can throw hands. These dudes are unstoppable. I'm going to be for real. Just the fact that these guys are clowns alone. There's four of them? How are you going to fight? Look at how big this motherfucker is. Would make me run on sight. But yeah. add on to the fact that I seen a dude turn into cotton candy in front of my eyes. Yo, that's I'm crazy. catching the next flight to the moon. I am not staying over there. At least Wait, what are you going to do on the moon though? They're from outer space, brother. Maybe they're in they are from the goddamn moon. I'm heading the aliens are less scary. Now these hoodlums do got weaknesses hoodlums. and that's their noses. If you shoot them on the nose, they inflate and blow up. So all you need to do huh? is get a gun or be real good at that baby game. Sounds simple enough, but I'm not gonna hold y'all. I don't think I'll have the balls to face these dudes even if I have a gun. They are. Clowns always oh gave God. me the heebie-jeebies. Every time I see one, I always catch malaria. I got a weird body. Hey, I got some to share. I've never actually seen a clown IRL. I haven't seen one. I've been to some carnivals here in Bulgaria. I haven't seen a clown, brother. But my point is, I'm Straight not up. fighting those clowns. I know my limits. I'm not Superman. I give them a two out of that, ten. They got pulled one out the because gun. I at least know their weakness. I'm just too pussy. Yeah, I'd run away in, immediately. 
the nun? The nun is this old ass lady that did a flip while attempting to jump off a building and now she's an evil spirit. She's <laughs> Okay, that's it. It just made that shit up, but it's a part of the that's... many ghosts of the Good conjuring Lord. series, and not gonna lie. I'm not the biggest fans of these types of ghosts. Not because they're difficult to beat, no. Damn. Because they're easy mode. These ghosts barely be killing anybody for most of the movies they're in. They just be fucking with the main characters yeah. most of the time and not doing shit. Like every 15 minutes in these movies, they're just like, boo, nigga, and disappear. And they, and they don't do anything else. They just scared them. They don't. <laughs> that is true. That is so true. Actually start doing stuff until the last 30 minutes of these movies. And I've seen most of the Conjuring movies and Annabelle movies. And I've seen the Nun 2. Not one. And hey, the only body... There was one good Annabelle movie that I saw when I was in America. It was in theaters then. So I don't remember which one was. It was in a small house. There was a... There was a... Well. It was pretty good. I've seen his like ugly ass hoe take is a little boy and an old lady. So this nun is Damn. the most little boy level. Then at the end of the movie, she gets defeated in the most lame way possible. Ow. You know, power of Christ compels you oh, type stuff. Brother. But it actually works. And then they spray her with holy water and some wine. I watch Boondogs. That shit don't work. And she gone. Th that's all it took. Of course I'm winning this fight. I'm going to beat this bitch like I just signed a contract to Man United. I'm Damn. winning. This is too easy. I'd even argue Chucky's harder than this preschool level threat. Probably Chucky got a knife though. He's stabbing motherfuckers. At least he actually kind of smart with his killing. Hey, I bet I can win this fight by <laughs> simply giving this girl okay. a Baskin Robin Oreo shake. And she's gonna that, start dude. tweaking right then and there. A hey. hundred out of ten. This is like playing against your little bro in 2K. Barbecue bacon burger. It follows Barbecue demon. bacon burger. Now it this follows. one is a little bit harder, but it's simple. So this movie's about this girl who caused some interest in a- Why was she in her underwear in high heels? Trying to run in high heels. Bro, take that shit off boy and slept with him but turns hey, out yo. this dude only let her hit because he had this demon chasing him and this demon like a std so the oh, only way to get rid of him is fuck. to smash someone else and give it to them now what bro this is easy as hell though 50 dollars for a hooker listen hey bro get out we got these g-man hookers real cheap 10 bucks suck your dick straight up happens if you don't, don't smash anybody well the demon will catch up to you and kill you only good oh, thing damn. is that it's always walking and not running so you got time to get away theoretically you can just run away from this demon for the rest of your life you can just move around from place to place around the world i mean it's always going to be chasing things? you but it's always going to be walking hey, yo, why is how walking long is like going to take the demon to walk to china if you live in china probably That's like I don't know a few That's a good question though. years, but it will catch up to you. So it's basically like that snail meme, you know? Okay, so me personally, something like this would never happen to me. I've never seen a Virginia in my life. Women see Damn. me and look at me like I'm a Ben Sharpio fan. Damn. I'm straight <laughs> repellent. Are women even real? I've never I'm, seen one. But let's just say. Listen, in order to see a woman, you need to leave. I haven't left my home for the last 13 years, so I don't know. One day, I but, actually got some. A woman actually gave me my hug. You know, uh -huh. happiest day of my life. I'm doing well, this spunky. Maybe it happens like in the movie. They never fuck you, but this bitch got a demon, so she fucks anybody. Big brain. Spunky. Then to find out she only let me smash because Yao Ming was chasing after her. Yao Ming. <laughs> after a bit hey, of listen, crying. If Yao Ming's chasing you, probably good though. Because that motherfucker got fucked up knees. Okay? He ain't walking I'm gonna have fast. i pass this on to someone else. Now, my first start is to give it back to the thing that gave it to me, but she ain't gonna let yeah, me smash she know. again. And I'm not a terrible person like the average Instagram commenter. The only way I choose to smash is with consent. Ah. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, it's pretty simple to get rid of this, guys. What the I'm going to hire a prostitute and pass it to her. And since she's a Straight prostitute, up. she's going to be passing that oh, demon yeah. around like crazy. So she ain't going to die from it. So I don't have to feel bad about it. It's a selfish Ooh. way of thinking, I know. I but mean, hey. Technically, you probably still killed somebody, but... I'm not dead. Technically, Unless you're you want to take one for the team, hey, then prostitute is one of the best oh, options. Damn. But what if you're like, no, I don't want anyone to die at all. I'd rather die myself than pass the demon on to someone else. Oh hell, fucking die out, motherfuckers can die today. Hell, it's known that they're gonna die. <laughs> okay, Deku, since you're trying to be a vegetarian, uh -oh. humanitarian, I got a second oh. option. You lucky I'm a genius. So okay. I might be wrong, I haven't seen the movie in a long time, but I think all you have to do is pass this on to another living being. And you know what else is another living being? Okay, brother. Hey, come on, man. Like, don't come on the dogs, don't come in the dogs, don't do anything with the dogs, stop, or the cats, or whatever the hell you're thinking about. Raccoons, tree, trees, 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 that's what I meant to say. 
trees. Are you gonna trees are alive, tree? technically. I mean, they don't talk or yeah. anything, but they living. So where I'm getting at, draw a hole in a tree and start going to town on it. Bruh, go crazy. It might hurt for a little bit because, you know, it's a tree after all. But I really going to hurt for a lot. What, what, what the If this hell? is what it takes to get rid of the demon and not killing another person, so be it. And if you're a girl watching, nah, y'all are dying. This, you Fuck might think, that. well, how am I supposed to do that? I ain't got no thing, so how's drilling a whole branches, bitch? Gonna help me. There's tree branches on the tree, shorty. Don't worry, <laughs> it'll work. And for the white woman out Throw there watching, you guys don't want got some horses and dogs as an CDs. option, so it shouldn't be that hard for you. That's how you beat the It Falls demon. Simple. I'm gonna give this a 9 out of 10. Not a 10, because I can't touch the demon, but it can kill me. Oh, Samara, the ring. Hey, listen, she can kill my ass anytime. That's all I'm saying. The ring is about these people who watch this cursed tape and then they die in seven days. First off, no one needs to worry about this. Y'all ain't got tape players. It, they don't exist anymore. I'm pretty sure they probably do, but you know what I mean. Ain't nobody watching that shit. What the fuck? Half the people don't even know what a tape recording is supposed to do. What do you do? That's bigger than like most of your PC parts nowadays. Like, what the fuck? try to prevent it. it's very simple i'm pretty sure everybody has heard of this movie or at least the basic universe rules in question the question yeah, is if i can beat this little ass ugly ass girl in a fight and of course i can in I a mean, movie i don't remember like ghost, nobody though. ever trying to swing at her they just in awe like oh, oh my god bruh send that <laughs> bitch to the stratosphere i'm fighting <laughs> she a ghost i'm pretty sure bro you can't punch a ghost can you punch a ghost i mean damn i don't care that your parents killed you go True. kill them not me i'm not even gonna do the easy way out by just making a copy of the tape and spreading it around nah that's too easy uh, as soon as i see that bitch coming out the tv i'm gonna just Bam! Bro, Bam. if I ever meet her, I'ma set up a YouTube boxing match. Jake Paul versus Kevin Leonardo first match. Second, me versus the ring girl or Samora or whatever her name is. Oh, and KO God. her first round. This uh, just technically, yeah, he's right though. She's short as hell, which means mid kick is high kick. Body kick is high kick. I love that. I can't put my leg that far anymore nowadays, but Twist? kick the hell off a child. 10 out of 10, bro. <laughs> I probably shouldn't be saying that. Talk to me, ghost. This new horror movie, Talk to Me, is about this girl this? and her friends throwing a little get together and playing this hand ritual game called Talk to Me. And in the game, you hold this hand mannequin thing and see spirits, and you can let them possess you too. But what not for more hell? than 90 seconds. If they possess you for longer than that, things get crazy. Now, you might be asking, why the hell anyone would want to play this game in the first place? Yes. And honestly, I agree. Why, why would I choose to get this? possessed? I, I don't care that it only lasts a minute. I'm not trying to have ghosts and demons willingly damn. inside my body. God, That's damn. the type of activity where if my friends asked me to participate, I'd be like, yeah, yeah I'll do it first. And then I just don't do it. But let's just say I get curious right. and do it once or twice. I at least definitely wouldn't go about the way the MC does it. She does the game multiple times just so she could talk to her dead mom who not really her dead mom. Um, she's just a ghost cosplaying as her. She goes completely crazy by the end, and it's too late for her. So what would I do is just not listen. What the hell is that thing? To the voices. I'm not listening to the ghosts or whatever demons or whatever they have to say or do. I'm not listening to no hallucinations. Hey, I'm gonna. I would listen to her in a minute. Assume everything is a hallucination, and I'm just gonna be mad on that. So yeah, I'm just gonna ignore the voices. Shit, that's what I'm like, already doing now. Kill them. Stop. Kill Get out. Joe Biden. Get out. Kill him. Ah! Are y'all gonna try and assassinate another president? At least this one's current, but damn. I find that hard to believe. It doesn't seem that hard. You, guys. Okay. you like Five Nights at Freddy's. What does that what? mean? Okay, I just watched this movie like yesterday, and I want to talk about it while it's still fresh. Okay, I've never actually played these games. I know automatons try and kill your ass while you're a security guard and like a some old ass building. That's pretty much the premise, I think. Ahead. Now, before I go off, I've only really played the first game in that one where it's in the bedroom. And my FNAF lore knowledge is finite. It's very little. Like, I know about the dead kids, but if you ask me who Perfect is, kids? I have zero clue. So I'm strictly basing it off the movie. And I'm so, fairly confident. But first off, I don't think you're fighting these things. These things are way bigger than you, and they're like automatons, which means robot shitters. Which means they're probably stronger than you, harder, they're definitely harder than you. 
and damn. Man, I can beat these robot Run, maybe? rats, bro. They're kids. I'll just do what the MCs did in the movie. Have fun with them, dance around, do ring around a rosy, all that shit. I don't even have to fight them. There was a, even when I wait, do, there was a Five Nights at Freddy. It was a movie. They get knocked out with a taser. These guys are taser level, bro. A random dude robbing you at night is a bigger threat. The biggest threat is that <laughs> golden robots. Freddy boy. Mainly because it's just a William dude who hired him oh, in the damn. suit. And he old. So I'm going to do my Oreo shake idea again. And that would knock him out cold. It's too easy. Now, cupcake robot. That's a little hard. They fast Cake and robot. don't give anybody the time of day. So I'm going to call up someone that likes cupcakes and do the job for or I think I won this match. Like I said, I don't know the lore like that. I don't know if they got more powers. Maybe Freddy will bust out a Kamehameha next movie. And the FNAF experts will say, Yeah, he's been able to do that since book three of the Holy Freddy, King's James version. Giving them a Damn. 9 out of 10, low diff. And that's all the characters yeah, I want. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, they seem like robots and robots will whoop my ass. Fuck, am I going to hit a robot with a punch? That should break my hand. To we discuss today. Was I right or wrong on some characters? And do y'all think y'all can beat them? I mean, I don't think I was wrong at all. Hey, I, I know. I, I I think I got the predator. I don't think that guy would look at me twice. See my pathetic ass trying to make videos on YouTube. Be like, <laughs> fuck no. That's like minus 3,000 honor, brother. No, my strength. Comment no, it have, down below. Go five hours go with my inconsistent ass, I got a little announcement to make. Oh, shit. I'm going to do another confession video. Oh, God. This what time, the, school. What is homie confessing? confessions tell me the incident oh that god anyway let's go here before we listen to some wild shit okay let me know what y'all think can you take some of these motherfuckers up can you can you take the predator is he gonna look at you and be like honor plus one or is he just gonna look at you and be like hell no nah. anyway let me know in the comments and i'll see y'all next time okay bye everybody have a good day